So do I have to learn API first or Selenium first? Which one is the first one I need? Guys, many of you ask this question hundreds of times. Pramod sir, should we learn API or should we learn Selenium? Like for example, I am learning Java with Selenium or Python with Selenium. Is it enough or should I add API also into the learning point or learning whatever I am doing, right? These are the questions that many times you ask, right? And it is very important also because if you are not adding API, which I think it's a mandatory to learn for every QA, even as a manual tester or an automation engineer, you need to add api which is important even in the roadmap also right we are going to discuss this okay so if you remember i have already given you a three months of plan how to become a python automation tester also second time i generally include api testing with python as well as automation why the reason is which is very important i have seen it guys whenever you target any company for example if you're targeting 10 companies out of 10 7 to 8 companies are going to automate their apis because according to the testing pyramid if you remember api testing is basically cost effective it is cheap as compared to the selenium test cases i remember in browser stack we are switching from ui to api test cases even in techion we are switching from ui to api test cases because those are cheap those are more reliable those are fast to create and they basically help you in execution also right reduction in the execution point of view also right so there are many many points that you need to add so my recommendation to all of you will be very simple is that if you are learning a programming language it doesn't matter if python or java adding api is the second step should be for example if you're learning java 30 to 45 days if you're targeting one hour per day that we have discussed with the roadmap already right if you're learning python 30 to 45 days one hour per day second step should be learning api testing manually where you can use postman also you can do automation in the postman also you can basically include library for example in python we use request in rest assured is the library used in uh, java plus api framework after creating this you can basically now you have a good time that you can learn about this selenium where you will learn about the advanced concept of selenium side by side so step three will be the selenium which i highly recommend all of you right learning only java with selenium or python with selenium i have seen it people getting rejected many times because they don't have knowledge of api one many of my students also i have seen it they told promoter api is something that we have not learned we have been following you on youtube but suddenly we have taken some course or something where java and selenium we have learned but right now we got rejected because in the api question i was zero so i got rejected so that's why i recommend guys in most of the things i highly recommend learning a programming language api as well as selenium these three steps are very important so my answer to do this yes it is mandatory add api to your learning which is very very important i hope this basically makes sense you need to learn api first then you can go with selenium which will be very easy create the framework framework creation is most important if you see right this is like for example python automation framework that we have created from scratch and this is one of the web automation framework from scratch so creating frameworks are important showcasing framework is also very important that you need to do it side by side which is very very important and if you need this day by day tracker how you can learn python as well as selenium as well as api testing day by day approach what is the step that we need to follow right i will share with you if you need it just give me yes in the chat i will definitely going to share all this in a pinned comment right so our target is 100 like and 100 comments let's target that and i will be sharing all this roadmap how exactly you can become a three months three months strategy to become an automation tester with the tracker with the frameworks also that you can basically leverage and add them into your resume with the projects information live project that you can all open source project that you can add into your system right i hope this video helps so answer for this is learning api is important and you should add it right thanks for watching make sure you like and comment yes in the chat so that you will get the all the links i'll see you in the next video Bye -bye.